Kingdom greetings and thank you for tuning in. This is Apostle Marlon B. Hester, Senior, Senior Leader of Greater Works Ministries International. I want to take you on a journey of March, our celebration of seven years of ministry. During that week of our celebration, we titled that gathering Grace to Govern, and we had a supernatural time in the Lord, and I want to take you on this trip. We had Apostle Stephen Gardner of Rivers of Living Waters in Chicago, Illinois. God wants to reach you where you at and bring you to another realm. If he's going to use you, you got to make up your mind. I'm transcending tonight. I'm coming up. I'm rising above all this foolishness. Uh, that wants to Myself, senior leader of Greater Works Ministry, I ministered also. You touched it, they'll curse me. Hallelujah. God wants to raise up a people who will tell the devil, I'll curse you before I curse God. Hallelujah. Job was so determined that he cursed his own birthday before he cursed God. We had Apostle Rick Daniels, my spiritual dad, came and blessed us real good. I ain't trying to be famous, don't want to be no celebrity. Don't be trying to walk close to me, walk close to him. You busy trying to walk close to somebody that can give you a promotion? Can't nobody give you a promotion but the living God walk close to him. There are some powerful testimonies that I want you to hear from some of our members and even our partners that attended the conference. Grace to Govern literally changed my life. I was in a, a rough season and it brought such restoration through the praise and the worship. The word was really good. I felt like God was speaking directly to me. Grace to Govern 2013 was very powerful. What really blessed me was the conference on Friday. The presence of God was really in the atmosphere, like really strong. We had Todd Delaney, we had John Jones, and it was just, it was amazing. We had praise dancers, everyone was just worshiping, and you really got an impartation, especially if you were a psalmist, if you were a minstrel. Um, it, was, it was really the, uh, nice to be if you really wanted that impartation of worship. Uh, my favorite night at the 2013 Worship Encounter was the night that Rick Daniels ministered. Um, it uh, kind of gave me hope and doing what I wanted to do as far as ministry and just righteously rebelling against false doctrines and teaching and just gave me the power to stand against things that were not, were not of God. My favorite part of the event was uh, the worship encounter Friday night. We had uh, John Jones in the building, uh, Todd Delaney, Phil Tarver, and uh, it wasn't about show or anything. We just worshiped uh, the freedom that was in the place. It really blessed my life and I really enjoyed myself. Our conferences are always amazing and dynamic. This year, we had a lot of talent and dynamic word and teaching. My favorite was Prophet Pringle when he came on Sunday, and I remember him saying that March was the month of a new season, and I'm walking in my new season as of March, and he also said that the camels are coming, so I'm waiting on my camels, and I thank God for that. I really appreciate everything that happened. The experience was great. I got to play for some great worship leaders, Todd Delaney, Phil Tarver, Fresh Fire Worship Group, and uh, I really enjoyed myself, and I can't wait to experience it again on next year and the many years to come. There are moments when the Logos Word and the Rhema Word interact, and Grace to Govern 2013 was that moment. It's hard for me to pick one night because every night was phenomenal. You really have to get the DVDs just to experience the presence of God. It was incredible and something that I will live to remember for the rest of my life.